Yeah, I know. That's nice, though. That's a yeah. way to have it. Or he can hear you now. Back to victory lane for the third time in his career, the second time this season, Chad Trout. Hey, it might have paid to be around at the end, but you made a great pass there around two cars at one point to take the lead. Oh, we had a really good car. It wasn't so good right at the beginning, but at the end it really came to us. And I'll tell you what, we got lucky a lot of... Uh, Good drivers got, got uh, knocked out of the feature, but um, you know, we had a good car, we could hang there right with them, and you know, pack Emmy plenty of room, I'll tell you what, he's a class act racer, I don't know if I would be able to get by him, but I could have hung with him, he just, he's a very smart racer, he knows where to drive on the track, but you know, uh, we held into the end, the car ran really good, I gotta thank TQ Fiberglass, he gave me a new hood to try, man, it worked awesome, Travis Racing Engines, this, this motor has 26 races on it tonight, and it's ready to be rebuilt, but I'll tell you what, he builds a good, strong motor. And all my sponsors, a Steve from Jiffy Lube, after we took that wreck up here in turn four the other week, I was actually going to sit out the rest of the year, and uh, he stepped up and uh, he took care of us. He said uh, he'd make sure we finished the rest of the year, and I thank the whole crew, um, every, everybody on the crew, they do a great job, all my sponsors, uh, Lee Chassis, uh, worked really good tonight. Just got to thank everyone or I wouldn't have been here tonight. Well, Chad, it paid to come back. We're glad you got her back on the track because it paid off tonight. And once you got into third there, you were right. You hung around and hung around. You kept pace with them. And then on that restart, you got those two cars at one time. Were you thinking you could get away right there? Well, when, when Pat went around the 94, I knew, he didn't know I was on the outside, but, you know, he came up in it. I had to go wider, and it got me up in the loose stuff. So he had a lot better run coming down the backstretch than I did. But, you know, that's just racing. And... You know, I would have been happy to finish second behind him because, you know, he's the best there is here. But, um, you know, he, unfortunately, he had problems. It was good for us, you know, and we had a good car. And if we didn't have a good car, we wouldn't have been in the position. That's right. You earned it. You were there where you needed to be. The next question is, where will you be next year? Have you talked about 2011 yet? Um, we're going to cut back our schedule a little more. We might just only run this track. We're going to kind of wait and see what the 360 deal goes. We only have one 358 motor, and instead of trying to build another one, we might lean that way, but we're just going to wait and see how the winter pans out. Well, we hope the winter goes well for you, and we hope to see you back here next season. Thanks. Appreciate it. Congratulations. Chad Trout, the winner of the Tool Shed of America 358 Sprint Feature.